Hello, I'm Alumide McCauley. Here's a Channel's Television Morning News Update for June the 27th, 2019. A federal capital territory high court sitting in the Bwari area of Abuja has nullified the criminal charge brought against the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Mr. Femi Gwajabiamila, the African People's Party, and one Mr. Anas Issa Mohammed, that Mr. Gwajabiamila lied under oath while filing Form CF001 of INEC to the effect that he was never convicted of any crime. The respondents had contended that the Speaker was found guilty of professional misconduct by the State Bar of Georgia, United States of America, in 2007. To security matters, troops of one mechanized division, Kaduna, of the Nigerian Army have killed 61 suspected armed bandits and arrested others during an operation in Kaduna, Kanu, and Niger states. The general officer commanding the division, Major General Farouk Yahya, who said this during a press briefing at the headquarters of the division in Kaduna, also noted that 20 kidnapped victims were rescued during that operation. Meanwhile, a senior advocate of Nigeria, Femi Falano, has asked the Chief Judge of the Federal High Court to designate judges to conduct monthly inspections of detention facilities of agencies of the federal government. Mr. Falano noted that if the request is not granted within seven days, he would not hesitate to file a suit at the Federal High Court to compel Justice Abdul Kafarati to carry out his duty under Section 34 of the Administration of Criminal Justice Act. On the international scene, Democrats in the United States House of Representatives have approved the sum of $4.5 billion in humanitarian aid for the southern border. This is due to the death of several migrants, coupled with reports of severely neglected children at a Texan border patrol station. However, the bill faces a tough path through the Republican-controlled Senate, which is considering a rival bill with fewer restrictions on how border agencies can spend the money. And in sports, Mohamed Salah scored his first goal of the Africa Cup of Nations as host Egypt secured a place in the last 16 on Wednesday with a 2-0 win over the Democratic Republic of Congo. Ahmed El Mohamadi prodded Egypt ahead on 25 minutes after Salah crossed and the Liverpool star slammed in a second shortly before halftime to spark frenzied celebrations at a packed Cairo International Stadium. And that's the morning news update. Don't forget to join us later for the evening recap. I'm Olumide McCauley. Thank you for watching.